Nigerian on air personality Freeze, in a chat with Heap TV, declares himself a product of a bad divorce and a bad marriage. Um, I'm a product of a, of a bad divorce and a bad marriage that led to a divorce. So I'm not very pro bad marriage. And I don't like people who make other people who aren't married or whose marriages didn't work for one reason or the other feel like they're less human. I, I don't like that timid fellow, whatever his name is. I don't like the, um, the approach. I don't like where he stood from. I don't like the point from which he looked at everyone else. How long have you been married? You're saying marriage is for complete people. What are you trying to say? People who are not married are incomplete. I'm done with that. I'm done with that. If you're not a certain age and if you're a certain age and you're not married, you're less of a woman. Or if you can't keep your home together, you're not a complete man. That's utter rubbish. Nonsense from the pits of hell. If you want to be married, be married. I'm someone who's looking forward to a great marriage. But if I don't get married, it doesn't make me less than someone who is. You know, so I hate that authoritarian point of view, uh, high horse, self-imposed high horse from which you dish out advice to everyone. Like you, if it was Jocke Silva, for instance, that made the statement he made, and she wouldn't make that statement because she, after so many years in marriage, you will know that marriage in itself is a battlefield. You know, it's, it's, you, you think you're almost there, then you, you, you keep working at it. So a, a, a young guy who's been married for how many years? Four or five years, all of a sudden assumes the, where's the hat of marriage counselor? I found that ridiculous. Former Mr. Nigeria, Emmanuel Ikubwesi, recently gave his opinion on Titan, opposing Daddy Frizz's online post and perspective. We called Daddy Freeze's attention to this, and here's the shocking response he gave. If you think tithing is what's going to make Nigeria work, I think you're on the bus to hell. You want to talk about building wealth, sit China down and ask them how they did it. You want to talk about a stable economy, ask Finland. That's the world's most stable economy, followed by Denmark and Switzerland. Why don't you sit down with those countries and ask them how they manage their their, uh, their finances to the point where their economy is stable. Don't tell me you're going to practice tithing to make an economy stable. It's ridiculous. Christians are not even supposed to tithe in the first place. Jesus handed, four, not Jesus, the apostles handed four commandments over to the Gentile church. That was the church uh, that wasn't Jewish and tithing was not one of them. So tithing is a Jewish practice for Jews. It has nothing to do with Christianity. It has nothing to do with going to heaven. Hello, Ten Commandments. Is tithing there? It's not there. It's...